Why are more and more Chinese chip companies gaining market share? How are they surpassing foreign competitors and breaking the Western monopoly? In today's global wave of technological innovation, the importance of chips, often called the jewels in the crown of modern industry, is self-evident. From smartphones and supercomputers to self-driving cars and AI devices, chips are everywhere, supporting the functioning of modern society. For a long time, however, the global chip market has been dominated by Western giants from Europe and the US. Their advanced technology, massive funding, and mature supply chains have built what seemed to be an insurmountable barrier. Recently, a piece of news has sent shockwaves through the global chip industry. A growing number of Chinese chip companies are rapidly seizing market share, even surpassing their foreign rivals. How is this happening? In the face of intense technological containment from the US and the West, how are Chinese chip companies managing to rise against the odds? Let's delve into the story behind this phenomenon. I. The Rise of Chinese Chip Companies 1. SMIC's Impressive Performance SMIC, Semiconductor Manufacturing International Corporation, a leader in China's chip manufacturing sector, has been attracting significant attention with its every move. In the second quarter of 2025, SMIC delivered a remarkable report card, a total sales revenue of $2.209 billion, representing a 16.2% year-on-year increase, a gross profit margin of 20.4%, and a capacity utilization rate of 92.5%, an increase of 2.9 percentage points quarter-on-quarter. The company even predicts a modest 5-7% to quarter-on-quarter revenue growth for the third quarter. Such results are particularly impressive given the increasingly fierce competition in the global chip market. During an earnings call, SMIC's co-CEO, Zhao Haijun, revealed that due to a steady increase in demand from Chinese customers, the company's wafer supply shortage is expected to last until at least October. He also specifically noted that some domestic clients, especially in the power semiconductor sector, have increased their wafer orders from SMIC tenfold in just two years. This data clearly demonstrates the strong growth momentum of homegrown Chinese chip companies and their high level of confidence in domestic foundries like SMIC. Analyzing the data further, the explosive growth in demand from Chinese customers can be attributed to two main factors. First, China's vast domestic market has an enormous need for chips, with demand growing exponentially alongside the rapid development of 5G, artificial intelligence, and the Internet of Things. Second, it reflects the significant improvements in the technological research and product quality of Chinese chip companies, which can now meet the increasingly stringent requirements of their domestic clients. Compared to their European and American counterparts, SMIC's ability to better understand the unique needs of the Chinese market and provide more tailored solutions is a key advantage that helps it stand out from the competition. 2. Widespread Breakthroughs by Other Chinese Chip Companies Beyond SMIC, numerous other Chinese chip companies are making remarkable strides in their respective fields. In the power and analog chip sectors, some companies have seen tenfold growth over the past two years, with particularly notable progress. For example, companies like Horizon Robotics, Huawei High Silicon, Black Sesame Technologies, Semi Drive Technology, and C-Engine Technology have all identified the automotive market as a key development area and are continuously expanding their client base among domestic car manufacturers. Nikkei Asia has reported that to prevent the U.S. from tightening export restrictions and hindering the development of domestic autonomous driving and other technologies, Chinese automakers and chip companies are intensifying their efforts to develop and adopt homegrown products and solutions to replace in-vehicle semiconductors from foreign giants like NVIDIA. This aligns perfectly with China's ambitious goal of achieving 100% self-sufficiency in automotive chips. China currently has at least 10 emerging and established chip companies focusing on the automotive sector, which not only promotes the independent and controllable development of China's automotive industry but also opens up new growth opportunities for Chinese chip companies. Compared to European and American automotive chip companies, Chinese firms have a natural advantage in collaborating with domestic automakers. 
local car manufacturers are more willing to work closely with homegrown chip companies to jointly develop automotive chip solutions that cater to the specific needs of the Chinese market. This close partnership accelerates the technological iteration and product optimization of Chinese automotive chip companies, allowing them to close the gap with their Western competitors in a short period of time. 2. Why are Chinese chip companies rising? 1. Sustained investment in R&D The ability of Chinese chip companies to make a name for themselves in the market is inseparable from their long-term, continuous investment in technological research and development. Taking SMIC as an example, the company's R&D expenditure in the second quarter of 2025 increased from the previous quarter, and the rise in administrative expenses was primarily due to the startup costs of new fabrication plants. This unwavering commitment to R&D and capacity expansion has laid a solid foundation for the company's technological upgrades and market expansion. According to relevant data, the growth rate of R&D investment by Chinese chip companies in recent years has far exceeded that of their European and American counterparts. In the past five years, the compound annual growth rate of R&D investment for Chinese chip companies reached 15% while the figure for European and American companies was only about 5%. This sustained, high level of investment has allowed Chinese chip companies to achieve continuous technological breakthroughs. In some key process technologies, for example, Chinese companies have gradually narrowed the gap with their Western rivals, and in certain areas, they have even managed to pull ahead. Investment in R&D is not just about funding. It also involves talent cultivation and recruitment. Through a series of favorable policies, China has attracted a large number of high-end chip professionals from overseas to return and start businesses, while also increasing the training of students in chip-related majors at domestic universities. In contrast, Western countries are facing increasing pressure on their chip talent reserves due to fierce competition and stricter immigration policies. This has allowed China's advantage in talent to gradually emerge providing powerful intellectual support for technological R&D. 2. Enormous domestic market demand As the world's largest consumer market for electronics, China provides a unique environment for the development of its homegrown chip companies. With the rapid growth of the Chinese economy and rising living standards, the demand for electronic products like smartphones, computers, and smart home devices continues to increase. This vast market demand offers Chinese chip companies a wide range of application scenarios and room for trial and error. In the smartphone market, for instance, China's annual smartphone shipments exceed 300 million units, accounting for more than 30% of the global market share. This massive market allows Chinese chip companies to quickly gain experience and continuously optimize product performance in the smartphone chip sector. To reduce costs and enhance product competitiveness, domestic phone manufacturers are also more willing to partner with local chip companies to jointly develop chip solutions tailored to the Chinese market. Compared to the European and American markets, China's market demand is more diverse and personalized. While Western markets also have a significant need for chips, their demand is more concentrated in high-end products. The Chinese market, however, not only has a demand for high-end chips but also possesses huge potential in the mid to low-end market. Chinese chip companies are better at grasping these market characteristics, enabling them to introduce differentiated products that meet the needs of various customer segments and secure a favorable position in the market competition. 3. Strong Government Policy Support In response to the technological containment from the U.S. and the West, the Chinese government has introduced a series of strong policies to support the development of the chip industry. From tax incentives to financial subsidies, and from industrial planning to talent policies, these measures provide comprehensive protection for the growth of chip companies. For example, in terms of taxation, eligible chip companies are granted a 2 years tax exemption, 3 years of 50% tax reduction policy which significantly eases the financial burden on companies and increases their retained earnings for R&D and capacity expansion. For financial subsidies, the establishment of the National Integrated Circuit Industry Investment Fund, with a total size of over 100 billion yuan, provides ample financial support for chip companies. In terms of industrial planning, 
the government has set clear goals and timelines for achieving self-sufficiency in key chip sectors, guiding companies in the right direction. This policy support allows Chinese chip companies to remain confident, increase investment, and achieve rapid development even when facing external pressure. In contrast, while Western countries also have some industrial policies, their response to the rise of Chinese chip companies has largely been through protectionist trade measures. This short-sighted approach not only harms the healthy development of the global chip industry, but also weakens the competitiveness of Western chip companies. 3. The Impact of the Rise of Chinese Chip Companies on the Global Market 1. Reshaping the Global Chip Industry Landscape The rise of Chinese chip companies is gradually changing the global chip industry landscape. For a long time, the global market was dominated by Western companies, leading to a highly centralized industrial structure. But as Chinese chip companies continue to grow stronger, market share is gradually shifting toward them. According to data from market research firms, the share of Chinese chip companies in the global market has risen from 10% to 20% in the past five years, and this number is expected to exceed 30% by 2030. This shift in market share will have a profound impact on the global chip industry's supply chain, R&D direction, and competitive landscape. In terms of the supply chain, the rise of Chinese chip companies will lead to greater diversification. Previously, the global chip supply chain was heavily dependent on Western companies, and a problem with any of them would risk a complete disruption. The development of Chinese chip companies offers a new alternative for the global supply chain, reducing such risks. In terms of R&D direction, the innovation from Chinese companies in emerging fields will drive the global chip technology to develop in a more diversified manner, breaking the technological monopoly of Western companies. Two. Driving Global Chip Technology Advancement As they rise, Chinese chip companies are not just catching up technologically. They are also actively innovating in certain fields, which has pushed the global chip technology forward. For example, in the field of AI chips, Chinese companies have introduced a series of innovative architectures and algorithms, improving the chip's computing efficiency and energy consumption. The R&D achievements of Chinese companies in 5G communication chips have also provided strong support for the construction and development of global 5G networks. This kind of technological innovation and progress not only helps Chinese chip companies stand out in the market competition but also injects new vitality into the development of global chip technology. Compared to Western companies, Chinese chip companies' technological innovation is more focused on the needs of specific application scenarios, allowing them to more quickly turn technology into practical products and meet market demand. 3. Fostering competition in the global chip market The entry of Chinese chip companies has made the global chip market more competitive. This competition will drive Western chip companies to increase their R&D investment, and improve their product quality and service levels, thereby promoting the overall development of the global chip market. Under the pressure of market competition, Western chip companies are forced to reevaluate their market strategies and technological roadmaps, strengthen collaboration with customers, and improve their products' cost effectiveness. The positive cycle created by this competition will benefit the healthy development of the global chip market with the ultimate winners being global consumers. At the same time, Chinese chip companies will also continuously enhance their own strength through competition, achieving an even higher level of development. 4. Future Outlook In the face of adversity from Western technological containment and suppression, Chinese chip companies have achieved rapid development, seized market share, and surpassed some foreign competitors thanks to their own efforts and advantages. This success is inseparable from sustained investment in R&D, enormous domestic market demand, and strong government policy support. Looking ahead, Chinese chip companies are expected to maintain their strong growth trajectory and play an even more important role in the global chip market. However, we must also be soberly aware that Chinese chip companies still lag behind top Western companies in some key technologies and core areas. To achieve a comprehensive rise of China's chip industry, concerted efforts from the government, companies, and society are still needed. The government should continue to increase policy support, 
and guide resources toward the chip industry. Companies must continue to innovate, strengthen technological R&D and talent cultivation, and enhance their core competitiveness. Society as a whole must foster a positive, innovative atmosphere and support the development of the chip industry. Please continue to pay attention to the development of China's chip industry and give a thumbs up for the rise of Chinese chip companies. If you have any opinions or suggestions about China's chip industry, please feel free to leave a comment and share them.